Welcome! If you purchased my kit on Etsy, these are the instructions on how to put it together. And if you don't have a kit, just go to what my website, it's down in the link, and you can see if there's any kits left. All right, so in your kit you will have a wood disc. We're first going to put glue on that disc. And be generous with the glue. Um, you just really want a pretty good bond there when we're putting these other pieces on. So you're going to have eight white pieces of wood in your kit and you want to put them together. See how I'm putting the shorter edges together? We're going to just start making the circle around this disc with the wood pieces. And although this seems very easy, sometimes if you're not used to doing it, they go together a little wonky. So I'm going to show you a picture at the very end of how your finished star should look. Now, if you followed me on social media and have seen me pin nail these all together with small nails, we're not gonna do that here. I'm giving you some very, very strong wood glue. And if you just let it set, it will be very, very durable. Okay, so I'm putting these last pieces together here. And once you have everything together, you just wanna let it sit. This first layer, just let it sit and then come back to it. So I'm quite, kind of showing you here how the star should look. All right, so I let this sit for about 15 minutes. Don't do this, let it sit for a good half hour and dry fully. You can see mine's a little pliable. But see this wider gap at the bottom of the star and a shorter gap? You want that wider gap facing you as you're working on it. Um, and we're gonna take the little pieces now and we're just gonna start assembling it. I like to pre-assemble it next to the star first so it's an easy glue up, which is exactly what I'm doing. So again, be very generous with the glue. And just get everything ready and by the way while I'm gluing this this is a pre-painted kit these are just the most popular colors whenever I sell ornaments so I went ahead and pre-painted them but before you start putting it together if you want to change the colors up you can totally do that and paint over what I sent you this is also a rustic kit so as you see in the pictures and when you're putting it together um, I have sanded off a lot of the edges and made it have a time-worn antique -y type of look to it. One other tip too is you'll see I'm putting this together on a piece of parchment paper. If you have parchment paper that's great. Um, you know it's just easy cleanup and should any glue get down underneath on that surface it's an easy peel off. Okay so now that I have the first colorful pieces on I'm just kind of pre-putting the paint down right on the star because I know exactly where it goes now. And we're just going to finish installing these very last pieces. And then again, we want to let that dry a good um, half hour or so. Wood glue dries pretty fast, so it won't be too long. And I do want to mention you don't have to do this pattern. If you want to do a dry fit before you start gluing it up and try different patterns, feel free to do so. I've done a million of them. Okay, so I'm going to flip this over and we're going to put the backer on there. So you'll see you have a long little stick here with a pre-drilled hole and some twine. You want to fold that twine in half and then stick it through the hole. And you can see how I'm just going to loop it around the top so that, you know, we have a nice tight fit there. And then I'm going to tie a knot on the top as well and maybe trim it up a little bit. Next, I'm just going to glue that little stick right to the ornament. See how I have that gap, wider gap facing me at the bottom and at the top? You want um, the little stick to go straight up and down. If you're to do it across the smaller gap, it just doesn't look right. It looks more like a plus sign, so you want the wider gap. Okay, so this one is already done. So you can see how that just sticks up a little bit at the top and it looks super cute. And I hope this helped you do your ornament. Any questions, just message me.